Hey, everybody. Hi, everybody. Good we're, afternoon. Oh, sorry. We're back. We are back. Good afternoon. We are Happy Art Treasures. I'm Steve. I'm Donna. And we are full-time resellers in Lincoln, Nebraska. Rehomers of stuff. It is. If you watched the last video with the clean out, it is the same afternoon that we got done with that, making that video and doing that clean out. We had showers. We rested a little while, but we can't stop because... There's Can't work stop, to be done. Stop. Got things to do. Got things to ship out from the weekend. We're going to show you what sold. We have a big announcement today also. On top of all the things that are going on, we, we have a big announcement we'll get to. And we're going to talk some more about the clean out. Just kind of give you, put a bow on that little yes. situation. And we're going to get on with uh, this aspect of our, yeah. of our world. So Let's go. All right, the first thing we're going to show you is already out because the buyer had a question about it so we oh, got yeah. it out last night and so let's take a look at that okay our friends larry and ruth picked this up at a garage sale for one dollar and look it is a brand new still in the box Ooh. oh please don't break the mirror <laughs> a brand new still in the box vanity set but they asked us to open it to make sure that the can the Mirror. mirror wasn't broken broken it's kind of oh it just needs to be cleaned and so now we can really see what else is in here a brush and over here in the corner is a comb look at that Isn't that cool, cool. So it's a vintage vanity set and that sold for $30 and it is going to Connecticut. Nice. All right, next up in the DVD box right here, we have this X-Men and Wolverine Collection DVD box set. And this sold for $30 as well. And it's going to New York. And that come from Iowa. All right, next up, we have two separate orders from the comic book and book by earlier in the year. Donna loves them. Do not. <laughs> There's the first one. It's called Danger Girl Odd Jobs, and that went for twenty dollars and twenty three cents. It's a comic book. Yes, and it it's is. Not friendly. <laughs> and it's going to California. And another one uh, today we sold. This one is called Good Girl Art, and this sold for twenty four dollars. It's questionable too. It's questionable too, and that <laughs> one's going to Michigan. My goodness. <laughs> All right, Donna, box 25. Let's get away from the comics. Yes. All right, in box 25, you're looking for or, uh, knives. They're ornate with silver overlay oh, Carvel Hall. Oh, they're in a bag. We'll get them out here. Ooh, them are fancy. They're fancy. Wow. Look at that. I don't know if you can see it. Hopefully you can see that well, because those are really, really cool. They are uh, vintage Carvel Hall by Bridell. Bridell. Uh, ornate Wait. with silver overlay. There's Ooh. another one. Oh, almost lost one. There we go. Those are super cool. We've had those a long time. Just listed them. Now they've been listed a while. Yeah, they came from an estate. Didn't Where's they? they? Okay, and they're going. They sold for sixteen ninety nine, and that's a heck of a good deal there. And those are going to Florida right there. All right, next up is in box 96. These were buys that I made on Bargains for You in 92. And I paid up a little bit for them. I paid $3 a piece. Life of the Party, their shower gel and moisturizer. Let me check. Body cream. And... Ooh, that's nice. Good. I'm glad you approve. I paid $3 a piece, paid $6. They sold for $28.99, and they are going to Kentucky. Kentucky. Yes, we like Kentucky. Yes, we do. Okay, next is in box R14. Here in box R14, we're looking for turtle. Uh, California USA pottery ceramic sea turtle. That's it right there. I think so. It's got flower wrap. Yes, that is it right there. He's a little planter. A little turtle planter. Obviously, he came from the turtle buy. And he sold for $14.99, and he's going to Texas. He's a cutie. Yeah, he is. All right, down to box 59. Let's grab 59. 
In here you're looking for a crossbody bag right there on the end. Sherpani, is that how you'd say Sherpani. that? Sherpani. I'm not sure. Look at the little zipper poles. Aren't they cute? Oh, well, that is cute. Yeah. That is a uh, Sherpani switch shoulder cross bag body purse bag tote thing and it sold for $16 and it's going to Virginia. I got it at a garage sale for $2. That's nice. I like it. Next is inbox KK. KK, the other way. <laughs> I had to think. Did you see my wheel? KK is there? right after JJ. And this is a cup cozy, and it is uh, number two. Cup cozy Another number two. Cup cozy. I need to put some more on. There's only three left, you guys. Yeah, Donna's been making some, so we'll get some more. Oh, there's ones three up. of these, and then there's um. There's some in another box. There's three Halloween ones. Okay. So this one, Cup Cozy 2, why don't you, you get that get out? Up? Yeah, and we'll show show what it looks like. There she is. And if any of you don't know, these are something Donna makes with her yarn. And she puts these Cup Cozies together, and we send it with a sticker. It's just $5 plus shipping. And this one has a little coffee button on it. Yeah. So it's sold for $5, and we said we have a special announcement. Donna, where's that going? Alaska. Going to Alaska. <laughs> it's going to Alaska. <laughs> That's Alaska. it, guys. Alaska. If you're new here, we have been trying to fill this board since oh, May 6, 2024. Oof. We've sent it to Singapore, Romania, Australia, Thailand, Israel, Canada, Germany, London, 49 other states, and we finally have Alaska. So Donna is going to color in Alaska, ah! we get and once color. she's done coloring that in, we're going to make an announcement. We said we had a had an important announcement, or a fun announcement, or whatever we put on the title. So let's let her color this in. Don't watch. Now I will say, while she's doing that, I'm going to tell you how this is getting to Alaska. So we have a viewer of the channel, Arkansas Junkers, thank you for watching. And they said, I know you're needing Alaska, and I have a friend who goes there to teach, so can you send her the gift I will buy? I think she will love it, because she is crafty too. And just like that, your map is complete. So, Arkansas Junkers, but hey, we are tracking where we're shipping to, not where it's bought from. So that is going to Alaska, and that completes our board. Yay! Be careful. That's it. That's it. There it is. The map is complete. Ooh. Oh, it's gonna Through, write today's date. What's today? September. Let me check. <laughs> <laughs> September 9th, 2024. So that's exciting. We will leave this up here for a while till we find something else Yay! fun to replace it with, but that's that was a fun little uh thing we did right thank you everybody that was fun yes. and thank you for the purchase to go to alaska so what does that mean donna oh we get to do a drawing yes we do for fifty dollars yeah we said we've been saying fifty dollar gift card when we complete the map and it yes. is now complete yay okay so what should we do um let's have them do alaska as the comment okay in the comment section on this video you have to put Alaska. It can be in a sentence. It can be anything as long as when we do like a search pick generator thing, it, you have the word Alaska in your comment section. It has to be capital A, L-A-S-K-A. -A -A, there you go. Because if it doesn't have a capital, it won't pick it up. Yeah. If it doesn't have a capital, it's not a state, right? Uh -huh. Something like that. Ha ha ha. Dad joke. Dad um, so we are going to run this in this video. Drop the word Alaska in the comment thread. We're going to run this about a week i'm not exactly sure what day this video is going to come out but we'll run it about a week and then after about a week okay so we'll let it go we about had, a week we had a business meeting there to yeah. make sure we had this straight <laughs> we'll go about a week and then sometime after next weekend so after the 21st so yeah. be watching we don't do scheduled what, videos so we don't know exactly yeah. what day we're going to do videos so we're going to let it run for a week and so and then, be watching because you have to claim your prize. Yes, you have to contact us and say... We're going to do the automatic picker. Yeah. 
And so you need to be watching. So sometime around the 21st, the weekend of the 21st, whenever we make a video around that weekend, we will be drawing the name. So make sure to get Alaska in the comments. Congratulations, Donna. Exciting. Yes. Good job, Steve. It's done. Good job, Donna. <laughs> All right, while we got you here and you're listening intently, I'm sure we're just going to touch on a couple things on the clean out that we did on the last video. We just, when it was done, we had a few things like to talk about and just to say about the clean out, but we were really tired and really just wanted to go clean up <laughs> oh, and rest man. a little bit. Yeah. So, um, People ask us a lot of times, like when people call us because they have a situation where they want to see if our services are, could be of use. Which happened today as soon as we got home while we yeah. were unloading. Yeah, one of our dollar auction so, uh, customers asked about what we do and everything. Yeah. And a lot of times what they ask is like, how much do you charge? On the channel, we don't talk about financials and stuff, but people do ask like, what do you charge? They'll call us and work? they'll be like, I have a situation. What do you charge? And we yeah. can't. Every situation is different and it goes by different factors on how yeah. we handle it. So if there's not been an estate sale and yeah. if there's good stuff that would be resellable, you know, then we would charge less or whatever the situation is. If it's really is. full, if it's a hoarder type situation or if it's just kind of what's left over after they've, after they've moved out. It may, there's a lot of different factors. Yeah. And one of the main factors that we deal with a lot is after estate sales because when estate sale comes through, it gets picked over pretty good. Well, like this estate sale, it was, they had a 60% and then an 80% off, which 80% yeah. off is crazy. They had full price one day, second day it was 50% off, and then the third day it was 60% off for two hours and then 80% off for two hours. Yeah, so what that so, means for us is... A lot of the good stuff has been picked through and sold. Yeah, mm -hmm. we don't have a lot to which go through and resell. But that's okay because in this situation, because of that situation, mm -hmm. like we got paid, we got a fair compensation to do the work. Yeah. I mean, it's a lot of work. And so Especially we did Especially in a day and a half. Yeah, we got paid to do the job and we feel the compensation was fair. So we're okay with not having much to sell afterwards. Mm -hmm. But so that's kind of how we operate and how we do it. We don't have a set price. We can't tell anybody on the phone like, well, this is what we would do and this is what yep. it would cost because we have to see every it. situation is completely different. Mm -hmm. So that's why like when we, you know, showed in the garage earlier, there's not much out there. There's, <laughs> yeah. there's really not because it was 80% off. So people are taking them bargains. Mm -hmm. So anyway, but it was well worth it. You know, we were compensated <sighs> fairly. We got the job done and now we're on to but actually, whatever's <laughs> next, you know, get back to listing and stuff because it does. It's like two days, then, you know, today we're not listing anything on dollar auction or on eBay or nothing. Uh, nope. So, I listed oh, she did. Things. She did. She came and took pictures of some clothes down here and listed on dollar auction. But anyway, yeah, it takes away time from our other stuff. So, we just wanted to like explain that bit of stuff there. We yeah. did, and it's not like we donated a lot. We, we, we recycle we a lot, did. we donated um, we, a we lot, went to the we threw place away a twice. lot. We, you know, a lot of stuff went a lot of different places. Yep. So, but anyway, let's get back to picking orders and we'll uh, get this done and then we'll wrap this up so you all can say Alaska. That's right. Yeah. That's exciting. All right. I have a few that I listed and I'm going to grab those here. So, first in R16, that's a heavy box. <laughs> At least I don't have to carry it upstairs. I did enough of that. That's right. So, in here, we have a camera. It's like a, here it is right here, this bag. And it is a, like a outdoor rugged, like indestructible camera or something. I thought that was a, oh not a walkie goodness. talkie thing. I no, did. I thought it was this a is a Pentax WG3 camera and it's like waterproof and it's what cold proof and it's crush proof and it's shock proof. So it's like an outdoor outdoorsman camera but it is all just really beat up i mean the back is really scratched up the lens has a few light scratches but i did test it and it doesn't seem to affect anything just light marks on it maybe they'll come out i don't know but so it's in so i went a little cheap on it and i sold it for 20 dollars plus shipping and it is going to do we still say where it's going yeah okay i think ask the people do they want to know yeah, that's a great question. Now that we have our calendar filled, do you still want to know, like, where is it going? I mean, I don't know. There's really not a reason for it, but... Maybe they're interested. Maybe we'll have to get a new map. Yeah. 
Uh, that's going to California. So, okay. and that came from Iowa. <laughs> Next up, <laughs> um, I feel like shipping. So I got this set. This was got the garage sales last week when Grams and Pops were here. Are those the hollow And these ones? are the hollow ones. Oh, Look at these. Look how are. cool they are. Isn't that weird? You can put your hand in there. These are Callaway. And if you get thirsty, you can drink out of them. <laughs> yeah. Callaway GES, uh, Fairway Woods. And I paid $5 a piece, $15 for all three. And it sold for $69.99 plus shipping right there. Nice. And it is going to, where is that going to? That, that is going place. to Kentucky. Uh, Kentucky again. So, yeah. And speaking of golf, it's golf is almost over, guys. We're getting down there. Tomorrow night's the last night of leagues. Yeah. And then the next day I get to go do a tournament in Omaha. That's going to be so much fun. I'm really looking forward to it. But, <laughs> yeah, golf is winding down. So I'm kind of bummed about. So You can still golf. I better get these shipped out so somebody can golf with them this year yet. Yeah. Uh, next up is a, another DVD out of the DVD cupboard. This is called... Mythica? I've never heard of this. Mythica, the complete collection right there. And this came from the Turtle Buy and it sold for $10.79 and it is going to Kentucky again. All these Kentucky sales today. Jeepers. Thanks, Kentucky. Yeah, thanks, Kentucky. All right, next up in the video game console. Console? I don't know. Video game drawer, we have PS3 Minecraft. I got this from a garage sale. And it's for paid one dollar. It sold for nineteen dollars and ninety nine cents, and it's going to Texas. Thought you were gonna say Kentucky. <laughs> nope. And then I got one more to show you, and then Don is gonna do a couple. This one is a lot of fun. Um, let me go grab it. Can't you give me a new home? Ah. <laughs> uh, this uh, she humors me. That's why I love her. <laughs> Part of why I love her. Star Wars Epic Duels. This is a board game. We got it at a garage sale here in Lincoln for 50 cents, you guys. 50 and cents. I went through, there are, what, I think there's like 500 different pieces and cards, and there's little action figures and everywhere else. And I counted them all. I checked them all to make sure all the parts were here. And it is missing one single card out of the Boba Fett deck one card so mm -hmm. if it would have been complete had that one card it would have sold for uh, around a hundred dollars but it's not and I did sell it for mm -hmm. sixty dollars when I went back and forth with a couple people on offers for how much sixty dollars oh, wow. and finally I thought you know what sixty dollars after 50 cents I think that is <laughs> A good buy. Don't so be greedy. That is going for 60. And it's just going across the river to Iowa. Iowa. All right, we got a couple more things, and it's time for Donna to shine and sparkle. <laughs> All right, Donna, box 31. Let's go there. Get out the way, man. Get out the way. Get out the way. Oh, that's kind of heavy. Well, what you're looking for is not heavy. It is a coach. Coach bag. Could it be this one? It's a tote, so probably this one. Look at that here. There is an authentic coach tote. Donna picked that up at the garage sale for $10. And that thing sold for $45. And it's going to California out there. It's a nice bag. Yeah, it is. That is nice. It's going to California? California. California. Oh, oh and there's there. a bag too. Look at that. It's even got the dust bag. Is that what they call it? Yep. Dust cover? Dust bag. All right. Two more things, Donna. And box LU is the first one. LU. Okay, out of box LU. It was out in the garage. So Donna just listed these, so she went out and got them. There are these two antique wood-framed Cupid bow and arrow pictures. Look at that. Isn't that cool? It sits right on here. Copyright. Uh, copyright 1897 is you what it says. the guy's name. Parkinson, it looks like. Mm -hmm. MB Parkinson. So those two right there sold for $26.99. Look at their little eyes. And they're going to Arkansas. Nice. Speaking of Arkansas. Arkansas. Anybody you want to say congratulations to? <gasps> you guys, we have a new baby nephew. Yes. 
Congratulations to our cousins. Congratulations to Miss Cora. She is a big sister now. Yep. To Andrew David. Yes. Chris and Amy, congratulations. We can't wait to hold him. Yes. He was just born this week. Right. All right, one last thing, Donna, in box R18. Okay, box 18 was out in the garage too, so I sent her back out there, making her work for Up and it. down the stairs. Yes. This little guy is truly one of a kind because why? Why? Look at his little. Oh, look at that. He's got a troll ring on his leg. That's cute. And we got that from the, was that from the holiday stuff last weekend or a couple weekends ago? What's it saying? I don't know. Highway. <clears throat> yes. This was from the holiday buyout. He sold for $15.29 and he is going to California. Is that it? That's it. That's it. That's it. That's all we got. All right. Well, thank you. Thank you, everyone. And if yes. you're still watching, thank you. Yes. And we had a bunch of new subscribers last week, too. That's awesome. We appreciate it. So it. thank you for all of our new subscribers. And make sure to comment. We love your comments. Yes. Uh, and definitely comment Alaska. That's right. And so we'll see you on the next one. We're not sure exactly what it's going to be. We have an idea what we're going to do next. But yeah. we'll see you on the next one. So thank you all for watching. Like and subscribe, Donna says. Share with your Share friends. Share with your friends, Donna says. And I say, what do I say? See you on the... Oh, I'm Steve, I'm Donna. <laughs> I don't know. We just go by the... We don't have a script. We just fly <laughs> with our... Fly by the seat of our pants, yes. as they say. So we are Happy Heart Treasures. I'm Steve. I'm Donna. We'll see you on the next one. Bye.